Uh, so stay tuned. Man, um, so we have uh, the genie here. Uh, and sometimes the genie gets a little angry, right? <laughs> Uh, we have to give the genie or the Don of the Best Damn Wrestling Podcast a little bit of room to breathe, to vent, and say whatever is on his mind. <clears throat> so, fellas and fans, prepare yourself for LPs. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my! <laughs> I like that. So, let's have some tough talk, Jeff. Yeah, yeah. I am sick and tired of everybody acting like Roman Reigns is the greatest champion of all time. I don't care about how long he's had his belt. I don't care how many days, how many. I don't care about that list of people that's on his on his hit list. Roman Reigns has not had a great championship run. Let me tell you why. Look at all the matches he has had, right? How many of these matches were really that great? How many of these matches were really that great? Now, hear me out, because I know it's a shocking thing to say Roman is not the greatest all of a sudden. First of all, how long Roman has only been great since he started this bloodline gimmick, right? Before that, Roman was getting booed up and down the damn city, left and right. It was not until since he came back with Bloodline that everybody's been up on him. Before that, everybody was booing. Go back and check the tapes until when he came back to now. <laughs> that's that's on the Bloodline. That's on the Bloodline. Me. I'm the I'm the only damn Bloodline. Oh, I'm right yeah. here, baby. <laughs> So my thing is, until Roman, a, a big reason why I never liked John Cena like that was because John Cena didn't earn it. Like, I felt like he didn't earn it like some of the other people, have, right? So when Roman started first coming up, people didn't like Roman because they felt like it was another Cena situation. They were giving them this and giving them that and giving them this. He didn't earn it. Roman to wrestle somebody now one time. He wrestled Kevin Owens. You know I'm going to bring my boy Kevin Owens up. One time. But 12 months or even 12 months, he didn't get a rematch. He didn't they didn't never continue the story. It was one and it was done. Look at all these wrestlers he has wrestled. It's one and done. There is there's there's never been another wrestler. Stone Cold, The Rock, Undertaker, Kurt Angle, they had at least two or three bouts with a person. Roman now hit one match and then it's gone. Then he don't got to do nothing for the next three months. But sitting in the damn room or show up on TV. Roman is overrated. <laughs> I said it. And I mean it. God damn it. Oh. <laughs> he said it and he meant it. Woo. Let that breathe, fellas. Let that breathe right there. Let that well, breathe. I, I, got a, I got a question. Now it's me. <laughs> with, with the point he just made, I me. a question. Okay. What if right. this isn't part of the story? For Kevin Owens. Say again. What if, was, what if it was meant to be that way? What if it was meant to be that he had that one match and they squashed it and then they'll bring it back because he's always constantly bringing his name up, constantly bring his name up. So what if that was a build up for a whole year to that Kevin Owens just kept going off in the wind and now he's coming back like, listen, this is what I did a whole year ago. And if it wasn't for uh, Jay Uso and and Paul Heyman, I would be champion right now. 